got up and grabbed my cane and tossed it. Uh, I, I just saw somebody at the window peeping inside the window. At that time, Seth, what I was thinking is like, since there are boys in there, maybe somebody was there trying to, you know, being a bad boy to see what is going on in the room, you know. So I said, won't you go and check? Uh, he didn't answer me. You know, he said, ah, yeah, I think that is just a cat because there is some cat here who has been And so I saw a human being. So I took my cane as I was going. He said, please. And he, he said, where are you going? Go back. And I went to the, you know, I, I was standing there at the bed, by the bed. And I saw him grabbing the, the kitchen knife. He put everything down, grab the kitchen knife. knife. And so I went on the bed because for me, it, it for my mind, as I said, it, it's just somebody trying to. And the timing too, I it never crossed my mind that the armed robber can be around at that time because it was around twelve thirty one thereabout. So I heard the next thing I heard is a, a key crack. Then at, at the same time, uh, 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 who is that in in Chi? I heard that that noise. Then uh, it's like somebody try. He opened the door. Then somebody at the same time tried to push, and then he push, he push back. Then uh, at the same time, I heard the the gunshot. Then he screaming. They shot me. He said, "Hey, they shot me. They shot me." Then they grew. Uh, as he's talking like that with his hand on the, his chest, they push him in with the gun on him. So as I also heard, I was also run through, uh, coming towards, towards him. As I heard his, you know, as, and they came and meet me with the gun, one on me and one on him, and another person. They pushed me, even pushed me back on the bed. While he was sitting, they, they had the gun on him with the other hand sitting on the bed. So they say, where, where are the phone? Where are the phone? And I gave them my phone. They say, where is the second one? I had to look for it in the bed because little put his own on the bed with the bed sheet has gone on it so i had to look for it and give it to them where is the money we were, we were not having any money in the house it's just some money little left on the um, uh, tv table and that one i think they have seen it and taken it before it's like there's some hundred ghana with some coins today so i quickly since i was scared quickly i said please come and check so i was just throwing everything out of the we draw for them to be sure that there is nothing through everything out. Then they were called convinced that there is no money, so they left him there and walk out. Then I grabbed this bed sheet and, and they tried to press on the on the on the wood for him not to bleed. I could I I was lost. I didn't know I was screaming screaming for help. Then I I don't also want to leave the bed sheet and go and be banging on, on the door. But at, at the time, I have to just leave it and go and bang at the door. Then they, another, they walk back inside with the gun on my head. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Because that maybe they are feeling like I'm going to uh, alert the other people. And they remove the key out of the, the door. But that time, they was, I was even hearing them in the other rooms. In the other room talking, I mean, the same way they were doing, I was hearing them even walking. I heard even they brought somebody to open his car. Mm -hmm. the, there was a small car to the, to, to, to open. Whose car, whose car is it? They were asking somebody, whose car is this? So when I heard that one, I went back to the hall to try to lock the door. And I saw that there is a, uh, you know, that metal thing that locked the door. And so I locked it up, up there. So at that time, I heard somebody after that, I heard somebody coming to, shake the door but they couldn't open it at that time so i didn't hear anybody again then i was there still hearing them moving around doing it doing things talking calling even each other i heard this name awuro 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 <sighs> then as i said i was still pressing the thing on on on, on him but since they are there i don't know i didn't know i can't open the door to don't know so um I was with him, and then at the time, that was like about 15 minutes past, getting to 20 minutes, he's suffering. Then I saw that the blood was leaking through his back on the floor, and it wasn't, I noticed it wasn't small, I got panic, and I started screaming again, screaming. Then I said like about 30 minutes, then he just caught up like, 
just go stand up flat once then the blood just uh, flew like uh, you know when they take water hole uh, the blood just came out <laughs> i got so scared and then he started hitting everything he to do in his blood the blood was <sighs> at that time i got so scared I, I ran back to the hall and was knocking at the door knocking knocking uh, I wasn't here. It, I, nobody was coming. The neighbors were not coming. So I thought that for me, they are also scared. They are in the room hearing I was so desperate and I was saying, oh, and I can't help. I can't do anything. And I, said, I was, uh, at least let me take him to the hospital. Hmm. <laughs>